Bem-vindos. Bem-vindos. No. Barigalust. Guaravento. Caribou. Funyenglei. Bem-vindo. Nenquan Dehna Metachu. Welcome. Your well-being is our number one priority. You're in an unfamiliar environment. You may be greeted by many different people, hear words you don't understand, receive new medication, and miss the comforts of home. Although you probably would like to be home or somewhere else right now, we want to reassure you that we will take very good care of you. Here's some helpful information about your room, what to expect while you're with us, and what we will do to ensure your safety. This pillow speaker is how you call for assistance, watch TV or movies, play games, and watch educational videos that can help you manage your health. Using our hospital provided phone, dial nine, the area code and the number. Wireless service is also available through our guest network. All patient rooms have a whiteboard. It might look different than this one, but here we will write your preferred name, list your care providers and their phone numbers. Space is also provided for your plan of the day, expected discharge date, and for you or a loved one to write down questions for us. For many patients, food is medicine too. Based on your dietary needs and preferences, you can order your meals by calling the number on the menu. Please speak to us if you have a cultural or religious preference and our staff will be happy to assist you. If you need an interpreter or translation, let us know. We'll provide these at no cost to you. Your safety is very important. It must seem like we ask the same questions over and over, but those are safety checks and we take the time to do things properly. Tell us if you hear something that doesn't sound right. Hospitals and healthcare terms can be confusing. If you don't understand, please ask us to repeat it or explain it. Staying too long in one position can cause discomfort, skin damage, and may put you at risk for blood clots. That's why it's important to change your position in bed. Tell us if you're uncomfortable or need assistance. All patients are at risk for falling, which could cause serious injury and take you longer to recover. To prevent falls, wear shoes or rubber-soled socks and use your usual walking aid. When you need to use the bathroom, please use the red button on your pillow speaker to call for assistance. We may also set a bed alarm, which is a loud alert, in case you forget to use your pillow speaker. Once your nurse makes sure you can get up and out of bed on your own, we will turn the bed alarm off for you. If you're in pain or uncomfortable, tell your nurse or doctor. We want to do everything we can to manage your pain. You may be given new medication. We will explain the purpose and possible side effects. If you don't understand what has been said, please ask. A clean, tidy room promotes comfort and prevents infection. Our staff will maintain your room daily. For your safety, wash your hands or use hand sanitizer after going to the bathroom and before meals. Remind visitors and staff to sanitize their hands too. To further minimize the risk of infection from your visitors, please ask them to use the public restrooms down the hall. For safety, we do limit the number of visitors in your room, and we do not routinely allow children under 12. It is important that you have periods of rest. Therefore, we usually ask visitors to leave by 10 p.m., but you always have the right to have a support person with you at all times. As a courtesy, our staff will announce themselves before entering and address you by name as a sign of respect. A nurse leader is available to assist you around the clock and will visit you during your stay. We are here for you and will check on you frequently. Ask questions, tell us about any pain you're having, and let us help you with bathroom needs or to change position. Patient privacy is very important to us as are your rights and responsibilities as a patient. You received information about our privacy practices and your rights and responsibilities in your admission paperwork. Members of our Holy Cross Healthcare team wear different uniforms so you can easily identify us. For example, most registered nurses wear royal blue. 
Nursing assistants wear Caribbean blue, transporters navy blue. If you're unsure of the uniform colors, please feel free to ask us. Planning to leave the hospital begins early in your stay and includes taking your preferences into account and making certain that you have the equipment, supplies, and help that you might need when you are discharged. If specific arrangements are necessary, a case manager or a social worker will meet with you. If you or your loved one is concerned that your condition is getting worse, not doing as well as expected or not improving, we want to know. Please speak to your nurse, the nurse leader, or your doctor about your concern. I'm Lou Damiano, president of Holy Cross Hospital. Our physicians, nurses, and support staff are dedicated to taking great care of you. Welcome to Holy Cross Hospital.